Uh, by ramping up the hot talk, the president argues that he has gotten China more involved than they have been in quieting North Korea in some time. The tough talk is working. Do you agree? Well, I don't, you know, clearly China is the key to this whole thing. Uh, China is the major economic partner of North Korea. China has got to apply the screws and tell North Korea that if their economy is going to survive, they cannot continue expanding their nuclear uh, arms program and their missile program. So China is, in fact, the key. People have been working on China for years. If Trump is doing that, he's doing the right thing. Two out of three Americans say... If North Korea attacks the South, the U.S. should use troops to stop them. Do you agree? Look, North Korea, I don't want to be doing detailed foreign policy or classified stuff yet. North Korea is a real danger to this world. And we have got to do everything that we can, A, to prevent a nuclear war, to get them to stop their nuclear program. And I think China and the rest of the world have got to come together uh, to demand that. Right now, Chris, I'm sitting here on Capitol Hill worried whether or not the uh, government is going to shut down, and I'm very worried about a proposal being, forth, being uh, brought forth by the Trump administration that we give $353 billion in tax breaks to the top two-tenths of one percent at the same time as they want to cut back on health care, education, uh, after-school programs, and the needs of working people. And I think the American people have got to stand up and say clearly that at a time of so much income and wealth inequality, the last thing we need to do is give gigantic tax breaks to the top two-tenths of one percent.